we talked about Dwayne's father being a wrestler, but actually his grandmother was a groundbreaker in the field as well. So Dwayne, in your new show, Young Rock, you were actually able to have a hand in casting her as well as your mother, right? Yes, absolutely. And uh, we have Anna and Stacy who are here now. What's um, up, ladies? How are you doing? Thank you so much for joining us. So everybody right now, um, from halfway around the world, here are Stacy Leilua and Anna Tuisila. Give it up! So where are you calling from? So I'm calling from Auckland, New Zealand at the moment, in a quarantine facility. Just got back um, last week. So yeah, here I am. Oh, wow. What was it like being like picked by him? Was that like, I mean, it's got to be such an honor that somebody's that into what you do and then to be picked for this show that represents his life. For sure. I, um, you know, auditioning for the role and uh, I, I guess you go through the normal audition process and you don't, it didn't actually dawn on me until someone said, hey, do you think, like, Dwayne's surely, like, casting you guys because you're his family. Like, of course he would do that. And that's when it kind of dawned on me. And I thought, oh, okay, yep, that's probably exactly what would have happened. And then that was confirmed um, when we chatted on our Zoom and you said you'd shown your mum and stuff. And I just, yeah, it's, it's just an incredible, amazing opportunity that I'm grateful for every day. <laughs> Well, can um, Anna, you want to tell us a little about your, your character? Yes. <clears throat> well, you know, thanks for the opportunity. Um, Leah, I play Leah, um, uh, Dwayne Johnson's grandmother. Um, very little is known about her because she was very much a woman behind the scenes. But she was a very strong woman, a very strong woman with no holes barred. She was feared, but she was well respected and loved by all. Um, she worked very hard to ensure that she lived on her husband's dream. Mm. And that was very hard um, in terms of working in a, in a male dominated sports, um, yeah. particularly during wrestling. So it was, it, she was tough and she had to be in order to, to succeed where um, the wrestling field is now. Kelly, Kelly, yeah. Kelly, if, if, if I could, if I could jump in and, and say that, um, you know, when we talked about how it's just so, so surreal, this entire process has been for me, I've never experienced anything like this in my entire career. And I probably won't uh, experience anything like this ever again, just in terms of taking a look back uh, at my life and all these defining moments and times and struggling times and the intersections that I've had in my wild life growing up. And now to be able to um, to cast, mm. you know, Anna and Stacy as, you know, my grandmother and my mom were the pillars of my life. And I was raised by strong women, by both of them. Mm. And this incredible job that Stacy has done playing my mom, but also that Anna has done playing my grandmother, just so you know, Kelly and, and your audience, my grandmother was the first female wrestling promoter. And if you think about it in the seventies and eighties, how wrestling was as a culture. <clears throat> and then on top of that, you throw a woman into the mix. Then on top of that, you throw a woman into the mix who's gonna be a promoter, who's telling these wrestlers what they're going to do and who's gonna win and who's gonna lose and, and how incredibly difficult that was. So she promoted with an iron fist and she was not taking any, you know what, off of anybody. She was incredibly tough and she had to be tough. And then, you know, eventually, um, and this is documented, and we documented this in the show, she was so tough that the, the feds actually brought her up on extortion charges. <laughs> now, that's for a whole other story. But this, but what they were able to do, Stacy and Anna, uh, and really ground uh, and, and bring my, my mom and my, and my grandmother to life, was just really extraordinary. So I, I really, I just want to take a moment to uh, give it up to these incredible women. I'm just so grateful. And when you see them in, in, in our show and the performances they give, it's just phenomenal. I can't, oh my gosh, like, I mean, as an actor, like, I can't imagine Anna getting to play, I, I say character, obviously it was a real person, but to play a character like that, someone's such a bold woman, I can't imagine there's, it's probably still to this day, male dominated when it comes to promoting wrestling. I mean, it's probably still that. That's what I'm saying. So it's still a pioneer, you know, kind of thing to do. So 
uh, to play that kind of role has to be incredible. What an opportunity to just get to play someone so bold and, and, um, and strong. Yep, I'm still here. Just waiting for you to subscribe. If you don't, I'll be trapped in this box forever.